Welcome back to Stuffo the Puzzle Bot. I love this soundtrack. Uh, I, I hope that it's playing loudly enough that you can hear it. Because uh, it's just... It's so... I mean, it kind of reminds me a little bit of uh, Naruto Boy, I think. Uh, it's just got this, like, just very... It's clearly inspired by, like, 80s video game chiptune type songs. But it's not that. It isn't that. It's, it's also got this, like synthwave vibe to it it's just it's uh oh it's great anyway um last we left uh we were trying to collect atoms so that we could unlock this little padlock over here and there is an atom in this level so we're gonna go in there and see what see what we can do so if you're new uh the way that stuff of the puzzle bot works is you're trying to pick up and rearrange uh these mobile crates and you're trying to use them to number one get up to that atom that is over there, that little sparkly red thing that's over there. And you're also trying to get to the exit, which is currently hiding behind my head. So uh, you're trying to get up to that exit up there. So let's have a look at what we can do. So we can pick up crates and move them around. We can also pick up, oh, this one's locked. Why is it locked? Interesting. Okay, so that's locked, I can't move that. Um, I can... I could put a crate in the water jet, but the water jet's just going to move the crate. Okay, I can pick this up, and I can spray my own water jet whenever I want to. Okay, and it looks like if I can get this water jet into that position, if I can, if I can basically laser that target with, with my water jet, it's going to unlock this force field. But getting the water jet into that position is going to be rough. So, okay, so, but maybe... All right, hold on. So, if I had three crates, I could do it, because I could stack the crates up to block the water jet, but I, I don't have enough crates to do that. And there's no purpose in going over here, right? This is just... Oh, no! Oh no! Okay, 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 I won't go that way. Um, so what else can I do? Now, what happens if I point a water jet at another water jet? They meet in the middle. Okay, so... Then what happens if I if I do it like this and like point them right at each other? That works. Except now I. Oh, whoa! What happened? Wait. Why did that? Why did it choose that moment to change? That's interesting. What exactly happened there? Oh, was it only staying there because I was there? Oh, so if I move... Okay. Huh. I'm trying to think. And thinking is hard for me. Okay, so if I... I don't know if the water spout can push two crates at once. And if it can't, it might be possible for me to reposition this in a way that... Okay. Okay, hold on. So let's... Let's see. What happens if I put that there? Is it, wait, is that is that where I want it? I think no wait, that's not where I want it. I think if I I think I want it here. And then I can <laughs> There we go. And then if I remove this, then it's it's stuck there. So that's cool. Yeah, so so the water spout can't push two crates at the same time. 
And so that means I could also set it up one step further over. Yeah. Okay. So I can do that. There we go. We got it. And then I can take this one. And then... Okay, so this takes me over here. But how do I get to the atom? To get to the atom... I would need to... I think I might need a water spout to get to that atom. Because I can only place crates where I've got this sort of like teal, dark teal background. I can't put a crate here. I can only put it where the dark teal background is. So I could put a water spout pointing upwards right here. But how in the world would I... Because these things are locked. I can't move the teleporter. But there's no way to pass through this force field unless there is a water spout shooting up into that target. Right? So, like, I can get to the exit pretty easily by just doing that, but... Oh! I can remove the target! Um... Okay. I've screwed myself. Okay, so... Hold on. I need some place to put that... To, to, I need a way to get back down with the target. So, yay! Okay, so now the target is here. So now... Oh. Oh. Okay, crap. Oh, this is just getting more and more complicated. Okay. So, to make the target immobile, I've got to do that. So now it's hitting the target, and now I can bring the spout in here. Wait a minute. Okay. I can bring the spout, the spout in here. Shoot it up that direction. Teleport. Oh, what the heck? Okay, hold on. Get the atom. Okay, get the atom. Ugh. But... I still need the water spout or the target to be up in that position. Okay. What the... What the heck? This is so freaking complicated. Um, all right. Is there a way, if I'm, if I'm shooting a water spout up that direction? Okay, yeah, I think we can do this. Okay, so. What I need, what do I need? I need this. No, not there. Yeah, there. I need that. I need this. And now I can put the... Oh, wait. No, we're not blasting the target. Okay. Oh, wait. Nope, nope. We can still do this. We can still do this. We'll make a staircase. We'll bring this up here. And actually, I didn't even need to do that, did I? Well, whatever. It works. Um, let's get this. Let's teleport. Holy crap, this was complicated. I, come here. Get on there. And we're out with the atom. <laughs> Holy cow, that was tough. Ugh. So, yeah, so <laughs> the advice I was getting along the way included Brandeth Court saying, just do a big old jump straight up to the top floor. Yeah, I mean, you know, it would be, sometimes it would be fun to port abilities from other games, but that's not a thing I could do. <laughs> Santa Hot Pot was confused by a few things that happened during this. If you haven't been watching this game from the beginning, it's, uh, it's a little rough to figure out what's going on. Okay, so, 
Now, what do we have? We've got this. Okay, we've got a target and a force field. And shooting something into that target from the from below will preclude me being able to go into the into the thing. So I think we're going to need to hit it from the side. We're going to need to hit that red target up above me from the left side. Because if I try to hit it from below, I won't be able to climb in here uh, and get to the exit. I also need to somehow get that atom. Which means... What exactly? Um, okay, how do I... Okay, this... The spout isn't locked, but I can't grab it. You can't grab things diagonally, you can only grab them laterally, and the moment I get on it, I immediately start floating upwards. So that's problematic. Um, I've got a lot of crates to work with. I'm just feeling my way around here trying to figure out what's possible. Because, like, I could theoretically make a pretty tall staircase. Okay, so, so if I place that there, that's what happens. And I actually lose access to it. Oh, wait, I can, no, I can still grab it. I can do stuff like this. What good does this do me? How do I... There's this buildable space up above the crate that's blocking the target. Why is that... Why is that a buildable space? I, I can't figure out how to get the atom or how to get to the exit. Both of them seem impossible to me. Um... Is there something I'm forgetting about being able to grab? I think so. Okay, so if I if I start with all of these downstairs. Oh, I know how I can get it. I know exactly how to get it. If I have all three blocks, then I just feed them into it one at a time. And now I've got a ceiling, and I can grab it. And then I can't get any... <laughs> I can't reach any of them! <laughs> Dang it. Okay, hold on. Alright, this is one way to do it, I guess. Um... I guess I can do this. Ah, there we go. And then I'll get the other one. Ah. All right, now everything's within reach. Let's figure out what the heck we're doing with this guy. So I think, I think what I wanna do Is place it is place it where this crate just was pointing upwards I think that's what I want to do except I'll be trapped in here if I do that right okay so what I need actually is for no okay if I place, I guess, oh, maybe I need to place it just a step higher? My problem is, if I place that spout pointing upwards, the only way, the only place I can do it from is down here. Or, I can, I can place it above my head here. But then how would I get up onto it? Like... 
yeah, so Arcanish says that they, they were gonna also going to suggest that I make a ceiling. And so it looks like we did, yes, we did get there. So I think, no, okay, so no, we're not going to put it where I thought we were going to put it. What we got to do instead is put it here. I'm just, I'm doing this by feel. I think we need to do it there. And then... What, I can't... Oh, I can't, I can't place it while I'm riding it up? No, I can only place it from the top. Well, dang it. Okay. Okay. I think I know what to do now. That's what I needed to do. <laughs> so now I can ride this up. I can get the atom. Okay, we've got the atom. Now the heck what? Um. Oh, okay. I. Now I actually know what to do. Okay, hold on. Let's. Trying to figure. Just, just figure out where to set these things so they're out of the way is actually half the challenge of this game. <laughs> this game is like playing free cell. It's like just figure out where to put the where to put the stuff you're not using is half the challenge. So, blast that sucker out of the way, and then we need to point this thing going to the right, up by the target. So I think that means. Something like this, except we need this thing to be on the other side so I can grab it. Not there. There. There we go. Okay, so now we've opened the gate. And now... It's still hard. <laughs> Oh, wait, no, it's not. No, I can just crawl up. Okay, for a second I thought I had to make a staircase up to it, but I didn't. Okay, so now we've got six atoms. So we've we've broken through that barrier. That's cool. But I still want to do all these puzzles around here. So let's let's do at least one, let's do one more puzzle before I head to lunch. Because um, I want to have at least a bite to eat before my first meeting. But I think we can do... Probably do one more. I don't know. I guess it depends on how hard it is. So we've got teleporter one of them locked the other one not locked the atom is up there we can crawl up here pretty easily theoretically I could place the spout right there going up and then I couldn't get out I can probably can I use the spout to hmm, to get up to the atom? I don't know if I easily can do that either. Okay, let's... First, first problem, how do I get that crate? I can probably shoot it upwards here and then shoot it sideways from... Over there? I don't know how close that would get me, though. Like, I can... Huh. I can move the teleporter to wherever I want it to be. So what happens if I, if I put it there, that puts it out of reach. Let's not do that. If I put it here, I can approach but I don't I don't think I'm gonna try to grab on the way down but I don't yeah I can't grab things on the way down so what if aha wait a minute what if I put this here there we go now I can get it because I can scooch over and stand on it and now I've got it so now the question is what's it for <laughs> I don't know I don't know what it's for so I can, I can put the teleporter wherever I want it. So I can use it to get out of a place. 
So like, for instance, I could, yeah, okay, okay. Let's, let's go grab the teleporter. And let's stick the teleporter here. And then if I grab the spout, Oh, Arcanish, I don't know what happens if I try to stand on a horizontal stream. That's a good question. I've got I've got no clue what happens if I've got a horizontal stream and I try to ride it. Like, will it push me to the, to the side a whole bunch? I'm not sure. Um, so I've got the Atom. I'm actually curious about that now. Let's Let's see what happens. Okay, almost nothing. I just fall straight through it. Okay, so... So Arcanish... Apparently has a suggestion, but I think I might have missed Arcanish's suggestion. Oh, but yeah, Arcanish, it is absolutely fine if you want to, uh, if you want to suggest puzzle solutions. Um, okay, interesting. That's what happens if I climb up through that. We, okay, I should not have done that. Um, so yeah, so the question is... Oh, wait! Oh, no, getting out is easy. Getting out is going to be the easy part. It was the atom that was the hard part. Because getting out is just... I can just make some steps. Like that. So really, the hard part was just getting the other block. The steps to the exit was no, was no big deal. There we go. We're out with our atom. And now I've only got 15 minutes left until my next meeting, and I would like to have some lunch. So I think we probably need to wrap this up now. So how many puzzles did we get done this time? I think, was it just was it just three? We need to step it up in future episodes. <laughs> Sada Hotbutt says, that was dead but easy. Well, the final bit was easy, but I, I you know, I, I had to figure out how to get that, uh, how to get that crate. Come on, I was feeling good about that. You're right, though. The previous one... I, honestly, the first one that I did this episode was actually probably the hardest one. <laughs> that was that one was pretty rough. But uh, so, Colosseum is suggesting that I should do an ASMR eating lunch stream. Uh, I I don't know if most of my audience would be interested in that. <laughs> and besides, I need to I need to cook it and eat it really quick. So I think it wouldn't be that interesting to hang out with me during this particular lunch. But um. That was another episode of Stuffo the Puzzle Bot. I will definitely be making more of these because this game is adorable and I love it. And the puzzles are really, really clever. Like, again, they're taking very simple sets of rules that are just slightly off rules that I've seen before, and then they're making the absolute most of those of those subtle differences between this game and other block pushing games. Uh, to make it so that, like, yeah, I'm just I'm solving things I haven't quite solved in exactly that way before, which is what you're trying to do with a puzzle game. So I really appreciate it. And uh I like these developers. There's a subscribe button, and here's links to other videos. And if I play more Stuffo the Puzzle Bot, you can click there to see it. <laughs>